picking up the music, so. That's my microphone, people can hear me though. Don't want my microphone.
Hello. <coughs> Sorry. Um, hello, if you can hear me and see me. Hi. Let me know if you can hear and see me because um, I have a new setup and um, hopefully it's going to work. The sun is setting over there and I can't stop staring at it, but it is making my eyes burn. Um, hi Wendy, hi Hayley, and hi everyone else. Uh, so I'm downstairs in my art room. Let me know, can you hear music coming through the speakers? I'm on a Mac and I remembered four minutes before stream started that um, you need to download this special thing called Soundflower so you can get your desktop audio and put it onto stream. And one sec, I'm just gonna refresh my chat because sometimes last time people were chatting and I couldn't see them. Okay, um, yeah, what was I saying? <laughs> I can't remember. Um, okay, cool, Haley can, can hear, yay. Okay, yay. Um, I was a bit worried because no one was saying anything. <laughs> so I didn't know if you could hear me or not, but okay, thanks Haley for letting me know. Um, so yeah, I'm on, I'm in my art room. I've got my new computer in front of me, hi. And the webcam, I'm looking down because I have, I'm using my um, iPad to have the OBS on so I can see everything's working. Uh, so, and it looks really weird, like the color and everything, my face looks so shiny. I'm not used to it, I'm used to my webcam upstairs, like the really bad quality one. So, um, <laughs> it looks a bit strange, but we'll get, we'll get over it, we'll get used to it. Your hair looks very pink. It's actually more pink than this. Like if I bring it in, see the difference between, it's like darker than it is on this camera in front. I might put it up later cause it's gonna probably annoy me. Um, okay, let me have a sip. I was just using this for, to get the uh, focus and everything right. But oh, what I was gonna say is there might not be any music. I do have it on my speakers, but um, it might, might come through, it might not. Let me know if you can hear anything. If not, I'll probably just turn it off because uh, next time we'll have it because I need to download that app or software but I forgot this time so sorry Artie's here hi Artie and hi Ria um everyone's here yay okay so this is what I did last night on Sarah Dyer um Sarah Dyer's Patreon and it was so much fun I'm gonna post it on Sunday I think because I have a few more drawings to post but I thought I'd show you guys first um so we did this Guys, is anyone a patron of Sarah Dyer? Because it was so much fun. It was like two and a half hours long and everyone's so nice on there. I didn't speak because I was shy, but I showed my work at the end and it was really nice. And we did um, people in cafes and I haven't drawn people for so long. It was super awkward, <laughs> but I kind of got into it around this part. Uh, hi B, hi Carla, hi Nina. And I got into it and I really started to enjoy it. And then at the end, I really love this page here and this creepy dude. So yeah, that's uh, what I did, but we're not working on the sketch page today. I will let you know what we're doing in a second. I'm just gonna say hi to everyone, popped in. Um, I got the bird stickers I ordered in the mail from you. I love them. I already had the Christ Jesus, yay. Yeah, some people collect stickers and they just, they just collect them, don't they? They don't do anything. So nice and clear in the new setup. Yay, RC, I'm glad that you like it. Oh, we did this yesterday. Hayley, were you on the call? That's so cool. I um, I didn't talk, did you talk? I Everyone turned their camera off because Sarah said that her internet wasn't the best, so I didn't see anyone. Um, But yeah, Hayley, did you did you um show you up work? I can't remember, there were so many people there. So tonight I'm gonna do something different. Uh, I'm not going to obviously do this entire thing tonight. It's a con concertina, is that how you call it? Concertina sketchbook. I've never used one of these before. I got it on a whim uh, a while ago. And it's an etcher sketchbook, accordion sketchbook they call it. It's, oh god, it smells kind of funky too. I noticed that today when I was, um, I noticed it today when I was, I don't know if it's because it's been in this box for like however long it's been in or if it's this material here. It's not leather, it says it's vegan friendly, so I don't know what it's made of, but 
it smells bad. <laughs> I will stop whiffing it now. Uh, I, I want to show you guys what we're doing. Okay, so on the screen here, if you look towards the, <laughs> if you please focus your attention to the top left of the screen, uh, we went for a walk, Martin and I, a couple of weeks ago, and it was super fun. It was a long, oh. <sighs> Uh, let me, this is me and mine, um, <laughs> okay, that's a video, you don't want to see that, um, right, let's get to my albums, gosh, okay, a uh, long sketchbook, I have an album here called Long Sketchbook, and so we went on this walk, and it was really long, a long walk, it was eight miles long, which doesn't sound long, I was actually nine miles, but it was up and down mountains, so it took a long time, and I knew I wanted to make, um, do a special project with it, because it was such a long walk, and I've had this accordion sketchbook for ages and I'm doing a challenge every week in August. So for example, last week I painted paintings of my paintings and this week I'm gonna fill out this accordion sketchbook and I'm gonna make it a journey of the walk that we did. So today, well, I first of all, I um, counted the pages. So there's 11 spreads if you do it like this. And then I picked 11 photos, including a couple that I can do details of like the sheep and um things like that so i have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven photos from the start of the walk all the way to the end of the walk oh message message retracted carla oh what was that Haley, i was i was there at the beginning but i had to stop for work ah oh, boom lover concertina accordion sketchbook see why it does a nice a5 one yeah this one's a6 but yeah this one's a6 a5 could be fun use it quickly then so you don't have to smell it any longer i'm thinking if i air it out uh it'll be fine love that idea for concertina yeah I've, I've seen other people do really cool stuff like a street scene with lots of buildings but i thought this might be fun so what i've done i don't know if you're able to see it on here because it's so bright but i have done pencil sketch you can kind of see it super faintly i've done a pencil sketch of all of them just to kind of make sure that they all go on and then what i was going to ask you guys because I've never done one of these before. Do you think I should do it all in one layer? So like do the whole book in paint and then go back and do the whole thing in pencil and then the whole thing in neo color? Or do you think I should do it um, spread by spread and then hope that the colors blend in to the next one? I don't know. So let me know what you think and we can do that. Stick a charcoal bag on it and the smell will go away. Charcoal bag? Do you mean like coal for the fire? I'm going to be using this tonight. It's a throwback. It's a throwback to like three months ago. It's the uh, jelly wash. And I haven't used it for ages, but I figured because the sketchbook is going to be so annoying on the desk, like take up so much room, that um, we'll keep the material simple. Okay, so Artie says do the whole thing in paint. And then Carla says it would be fun to do it as one long landscape. Okay, that's what we'll do. I only, all I need is two people to tell me things, even sometimes even one person. Haley's the third. Okay, cool. Let me clear some space then, because we're gonna have this hanging off the desk. Guys, I can't hear any music at all, can you? I mean, can you hear any music? Because I will, I will stop it if you can't, because I don't like that playlist. I only play it for, for um, stream. Activated charcoal bags. I have one in my husband's closet for obnoxious, for obvious reasons. Ah, okay, cool, cool. I never heard of that. Katie's here, hi Katie. And Wendy cannot hear the music. Okay, cool, I can't either, because I turned it off now. <laughs> um, right, so there's my phone. We don't want to look at that, just in case I get any, any sensitive messages. Um, so I'm gonna go for it. <laughs> I'm gonna hope, I'm gonna put my, my mouse over here. Cool. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna hope that, um, the, the I remember everything because I have done a fake pencil line but yeah we're just gonna go for it guys no more messing around we'll see if we can get at least we'll see if we can get at least the the paint layer done tonight because I have I have basically the rest of the week to work on this it's meant to start on Monday but I, I, I have been behind from the previous week and the previous week so I haven't got around to it um also, I'm not using my big paint brush tonight because it's a smaller sketchbook. I've, this is the biggest brush I have, down from the huge house paint brush. So I'm going to use this. And then I also have a couple of smaller brushes. Just so you know. 
sorry for my typos, I'm on a bed and cannot type on this, not a prop, oh, on an iPad, don't worry, Artie, honestly, you are typing wrong, I am reading wrong, we make a pair, it's fine. Okay, so, oh, okay, so I better get the photo up. <laughs> First photo, gosh, I'm gonna reach all the way across the desk. First photo is Brothers Water. So this walk started at a, at a lake, a body of water called Brothers Water. And it's a beautiful little lake, tiny little lake. Um, and there's some mountains in the background. <laughs> I can't really tell you much else. I'm not sure what colors I'm gonna do. Guys, this is the first time in like a month that I've had free reign of colors and I'm a bit nervous to be honest. <laughs> Are you going to stay on YouTube for streams from now on? Then I can get rid of Twitch. I was only there for you. Oh, Nina, that's funny. But yes, I am. I'm going to stay on YouTube from now on. Uh, I have really enjoyed being on YouTube, and I think I think it allows more people to join, which is nice. So, yeah, I'm going to stay on YouTube. So you can delete Twitch. Although I would mention that there are some really good streamers that just do Twitch. So if you are into streaming, um, you might find some, some fun people to watch on there. I did really like Twitch, but also it stressed me out because there's so much you need to do on there. Like, there's so much you can do on there. That, um, like with the emotes and the points and the, oh, it's just so much stuff and I just couldn't, oh, I'm just lazy, I just don't have time. Typos are my MO, it doesn't matter what I type on. I think everyone, sometimes I'm so lazy. I think I mentioned this last week. I'm so lazy that I'll make a typo and I know it's wrong and I still just press send. Like I don't even press, you know, like sometimes you get the auto correct. Um, you can press the auto correct button to send it. I don't even do that, I'm so lazy. So I haven't used gouache for so long, jelly gouache. And I don't know how this paper is. If anyone has used this paper, let me know. It's the Etcher Accordion Sketchbook Hot Press. 100% cotton, so it should be good paper. Doesn't say the weight though. I don't know. I'm gonna guess 160. <laughs> no, I have I have literally no idea. But I'm gonna try and keep it quite simple because we have a lot to do, and I also don't want it to take ages to dry. I feel like I haven't used this color in so long. This oh my god, I'm just looking at the color on on stream it's not that bright guys I might have to fiddle with the I put a filter on earlier because it was looking a bit grey but I might have to turn okay I'm gonna turn the colour correct off which basically was just a tiny bit of saturation and contrast oh my god it's still green it is not that green it's like luminous can you guys see that how bright luminous green that is maybe if I get it closer to the camera you'll be able to see it clearer Clearer. Nope, <laughs> that is fluorescent green. Let's zoom in a little bit. I'm using my new camera. I, oh God, so the sun is coming in. Can you guys see the sun? So bright. I just stared at it and I can't see anything. Uh, if, you're putting, if you're putting more effort into YouTube, as you said, the live streams will help. Yes, that's what I'm helping. That's what I'm hoping, Artie that the live streams um, help me out because I would really like to grow my YouTube. It feels weird with that music. I know that you guys can't hear it, but I'm going to play it because it feels weird without it. It's just stream beats. Okay, that's better. It looks neon, I know. It's not though. If you guys have this this jelly gouache, you'll know it's like very bright lime green, but it definitely isn't neon. It's fine. I'm gonna go over this with pencil too. This is just literally um, it's just a bit of colour, you know, in the background. I just I haven't used these paints for so long. I've kind of forgotten what all the colours are. So I'm probably gonna make a bit of a mess of it, but it'll be fine. It's more about hanging out, right? Hanging out and chatting than about creating an amazing artwork. So what's everyone up to? Are you guys drawing today? Or 
Are you just chilling out? You washing the dog? One day, someone will be washing the dog. I don't know when. I don't know when that day will come. But one day I'll ask if someone's washing the dog and someone will be washing the dog while watching the stream. And that'll be a glorious day for all of us. So these paints have dried out. I did have a video, God, it must have been ages ago now, where I actually re-wetted all these paints and they do not stay, they do not stay wet for long, my word. Okay, well, that was... I mean, that's an interesting first spread. We'll move on. <laughs> we can cover some of this up. I don't like this dark blue. I'm not gonna use this again. That was a mistake, I think. It makes everything muddy. Moving on. I would not rest the iPad in the bathroom while washing the floor. He would drench it. Let's try, I did not think about how you would wash the dog, what device you'd watch on. Okay, let's move on to the next photo, which hopefully you'll be able to see as I go on how I kind of tried to link these together. So, I'm trying to find the black. I don't, I don't think there is a black actually. I think I took it out. Okay, that's fine. We we'll use like a, I don't know, the sandy color, I guess. No, we won't use that. We'll use, hmm, I'm trying to, these colors are actually quite limited when I think about it. Okay, we'll use this peachy color at the back. I've been doing computer work most of the morning and I'm just tidying my desk. I need to give this room not a tidy up but like a huge uh, spring clean because I've got stuff everywhere that I don't need. Like I have boxes just full of junk, like I've just been putting like receipts and uh, prints that I haven't put on the wall yet that I've like bought from people and old paper, scraps, things like that. I can't feel this is going to be quite difficult as we go on because there's nowhere to hold. There's nowhere to hold on to. Oh god, it smells so bad. Wait, that could be the paint that smells bad actually. I don't know, something smells pretty bad. At the start of the video I had, because I don't have the music, normally I have the desktop playing uh, at the start. And I have my microphone off, but today, because I don't have the music, because I haven't put that sound flower on, I just had the desktop audio playing, and I pressed the start in soon video, and luckily I realised I had my microphone on, because sometimes I make noises while I'm waiting for stream to start. Um, and not just creaking chairs. <laughs> oh, that was my phone bragging. I got some new Posca pens today from Hobbycraft because they were half price. They were half price, but they were like 20 pounds a pen from Hobbycraft. They're expensive there. That's cool though. What colors did you get? I love the pastel colors. I'm not a really big fan of the other ones. All right, I'm just trying to kind of blend these in. I don't know how this is gonna work, but I think it'd be fun. I saw, who was it that had kind of a, a really cool accordion sketch on their Instagram the other day. I can't remember who it was. I think it, I, I wanna say it was Melanie Chadwick, but I don't think it was. Could be getting confused with someone else. I was drawn for a new sticker pack earlier watching The Sandman. What do you think of The Sandman? No spoilers, obviously, if people wanna watch it. No spoilers, but. I couldn't really get into it. I had such high hopes and I just, I haven't read the books though, so maybe I need to read the books. But yeah, I just, I don't know. I can't, I think I will, we watched four episodes and I found myself just kind of wanting to not watch anymore. I probably will though, but yeah, maybe I should read the books. They'll probably make me feel like I know more what's going on. It's a bit confusing if you haven't, I think. So I'm making these walls pink for some reason. Use washi to hold it down, that's a good idea. I don't have any washi on this table. It's fine, once we kind of get to the edge of the table, the edge of the table is ages away. It's still, it's probably like two more, two, like this far away. And then we'll just let it dangle off and hopefully the paint doesn't all run downhill. <laughs> we'll be fine. You can lighten it up with Neo colors, exactly. 
thoughts on luminance versus prismacolor i'm having a hard time finding where to buy luminance singles Haley, are you in the uk or are you in america or are you in another country <laughs> wait there's more countries than england and america uh yeah let me know where you are because it should be pretty easy if you're in either of those two countries or even parts of europe because i'm pretty sure you can get them from jackson's arts pretty easily maybe not, actually no you can you can do worldwide from jackson's art so i just know that it's quite pricey depending on what country the shipping is all right we're almost we're almost there guys only nine to go after this <laughs> luminance are so much better than prism color in my opinion but they're a lot more expensive at least out here in Canada. Yeah, I was uh, I, I was gonna say Illuminance, I can't really uh, I can't really answer that question very well because I've only ever had Prismacolor Color Rays pencils and I did not like them. They always broke for me. And yeah, Illuminance is my favorite pen color pencil of all the color pencils. So at the moment, and I haven't tried every color pencil, but I've tried quite a lot and so if you're gonna ask me like the luminance or what this pencil luminance or that pencil I would probably always say luminance just because I love them I've heard the Sandman is good yeah I mean it's not I, I think it's visually nice I just didn't really I couldn't really connect with the characters I got a pack of 16 for 21 pounds the pesto ones sadly weren't a part of the sale that's a shame Pastel ones are so nice. Still pretty good though. Can we see how red my face is? I think it's the sunset. <laughs> Am I, is my face really red? I can't tell because on my iPad it's like tomato, but then when I look on the computer, it's kind of normal. Let me know how red my face is. I see so many people using them. I'm trying to find them in the US. In the US, okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure. I know Jackson Sarts do deliver worldwide, but they may be expensive for you in the US. What's that other, is it, I think it's Hobby, is it Hobby, Sam's? No, I'm trying to think of the names of the US shops. If anyone's from the US and knows, sh like, let me know, let, let us know, because I, I don't live there. I mean, surprise. <laughs> sorry, I, I don't know, sorry. Hobby Lobby. That's like your version of Hobby Craft, right? There's another one, Bix. No, Blix, Blix. I've heard that Blix have them. I'm just gonna shut the curtain because the sun is blinded me. There we go, that's better. Oh, Dick Blick, that's the one. I'll have a look into Blick. I've seen the company from Sandy Hester. Sandy Hester, I've seen everything from Sandy Hester. She was on Sa she was on Sarah Dyer yesterday. Sarah Dyer's thing. It was so cool. I was like, I'm on the same call as Sandy Hester. And she was talking about this pencil and everyone was like, yeah, the pencil's amazing. And I was thinking, I've already spent 200 pounds after watching your video, Sandy. I can't buy any more. <laughs> so I'm sorry. I gotta put a block on inspirational buying now. Oh, Michaels. Yes, I've heard of Michaels. Cheap Joes. Ooh, I haven't heard of Cheap Joes. All right, moving on to the next one. Do you think Cheap Joes is really cheap or do you think they just put it in the name to like fake you out? Yeah, come down to Cheap Joes. We're really um affordable, but then they just quietly go into the back room and laugh because they're not actually affordable at all. In my head, that is what's happening at Cheap Joes. Sandy Hester is enabling us to buy art materials. She is. But let's be fair, everyone, I'm pretty sure every artist on YouTube is an enabler as like at some point. All right, I'm gonna try and make these clouds. I just realized I don't have my black. It's under my, in my desk somewhere. Let me see if I can find it. Cause I need to make a gray. I found it it's so much fun being down here because I can literally just turn around. Like normally when I'm upstairs and I have to do stuff, I have to run downstairs and get things. 
Oh my word, it's so dry. Look how dry it is. Dharma Trader may also have them. Dharma Trader, you guys have so many shops. We just literally have Jackson's Arts, Cass Arts. What else? Hobbycraft and Amazon, I guess. Court pens, we got court pens as well. I was on court pens the other day. I was trying to find like different, I don't need them, but I was just, I think I was in a work meeting and I was kind of bored. It was like an hour long and I didn't really, they were talking about stuff that basically it wasn't about my part of the project. It was about the, the project itself, but not my part. So I was kind of zoning out a little bit. And um, I was on, I was online on Amazon. No, I wasn't. I was on uh, Cool Pens. Just having a browse because I've heard they're really good for like pens, like different pencils and stuff. And I put a whole bunch in the basket and then I, I didn't go back and buy them. I'm just, I'm doing this thing now where it's kind of like window shopping, but I just go to places. I went to Jackson's Arts yesterday and I added like 40 pounds worth of pencils to the basket and then I just left. Uh, yeah, and then it kind of like scratches that itch of <laughs> wanting to buy something. Also, I'm sorry if my chair is so squeaky. Can you hear it? I've only had it since November, but Squeakathon. Isn't this a lovely, vibrant, look how beautiful that light is in the valley. I'm gonna try and get that with my neon green. This is gonna be so cool when it's finished. Natasha Newton is another YouTuber that always makes me wanna buy new art supplies. Yeah, I started with Natasha Newton uh, with the buy-in on the buy-in train, but I think I pretty much, I have pretty much everything she, she uses now, <laughs> so. Oh, a bit of WD-40. You know what, I don't think we actually have any WD-40 in the house. Might have to ask Martin if we got in the garage. It's a good idea though. It was a kind of a cheap chair. Got it from, I can't remember where I got it from actually. Uh, one of these places that sells chairs online. You know the kind. And I only got it because it matched my curtains. Not because it looked comfortable or anything. It was, it is quite comfortable actually. It's got like a nice wide seat so I can put my legs up because I like to, I can even cross both my legs. You can't see them right now, but look, I'll do it and then you'll be able to tell how zen I am because I'm in cross legged Like a yogi. You should totally do how to stream on YouTube so Wendy and I can be inspired to start. Maybe I will once I get the hang of it because the light, either something is bad all the time, either the lighting or um, the cameras that are focus, or I don't, I don't have any music playing <laughs> because I forgot. So, but yes, that's an interesting idea. I actually really want to do um, a setup video. So for my new setup that I have, so I may include that. Maybe I can do like a setup how I how I set up for streaming and filming, and then that will have it in there. But for the actual how to stream itself, I'm it's kind of apart from the technical stuff, it's uh, just about having the confidence to do it. I think it took me a while, and I was really nervous the first few times. But when I know that people are coming, like you guys are gonna be here and keep me company, it's not so bad. It's fun. Veg oil. <laughs> you know what, Arcee? We don't have any oil in the house either. I used it all up ages ago, like a few months ago, and it takes us ages to use a bottle of oil anyway, but I used it all up and then I haven't bought any more. And I also haven't bought any margarine or any butter because I'm trying to be healthy. And if it's in the house, I will... If, if I have margarine in the house, like Flora, and I have bread, they will be gone. If I just have bread, I can kind of resist it, but... As soon as margarine's in the house, I'm all over that. So yeah, I just I'm trying not to buy anything that I will, that will, you know, get me off track because I have been trying to be, I'm trying to be eat really healthily lately, and it's really hard. <laughs> it's really hard, guys. I made healthy muffins late earlier on because I haven't had any treats or snacks or anything, and we the use applesauce instead of like butter or anything. Um, or sugar, and it's basically just like flour, baking soda, um, what else? 
applesauce, cinnamon, and they were so good. And I had two of them. <laughs> so that's how my healthy, healthy lifestyles go in. Just casually making cupcakes on a, on a Wednesday night. I'm so nervous to live stream. I have no idea what I would do. Yeah, it's difficult, Wendy. It's difficult. I'm not gonna lie. The first few were, actually the first one was really cool because I literally told everyone, like all my friends, uh, all my art friends. I was like, please come to stream just in case no one turns up. So actually that was quite good. But I try not to beg people to come anymore. I just hope they come. <laughs> but Wendy, if you ever live stream, I will be there. 100% so you'll have at least me watching you and I'm sure other people will come too I don't know what you can do though like drawing wise maybe do a prompt or maybe do something easy that you can do that you can focus on the stream as well so maybe that's what I do on stream I don't do anything super crazy it's like right now I'm just doing the background for this and it's just painting I mean I'm not even putting the right colors down it's a hot mess right now but it's fine I don't mind Oh, you know what could be fun, Wendy? Like a draw this in your style. That could be kind of fun. Okay. I know that you guys can't hear the music, but I can, and it's awful. Let me just... Yes, I mean the setup. Okay, Artie, cool. I'm not nervous about streaming because I used to do it on Instagram. See, I would... I'm so nervous to stream on Instagram, I can't do it. There's a huge wasp outside. Please don't come in. I have the window open. It's tapping against the glass. What was I saying? Uh, yeah, Instagram. I can't do Instagram. I don't know why. I think it's because I don't know. I didn't. I didn't understand how to do it with the comments and stuff. Like, how do you respond to comments? Okay, let's move on to the next photo. Can we just do this? Yes, that's sheep. This is the next one. This is a gate. Okay, so on the walk, this is the first hill that we had to climb up out of four mountains, okay? So this here, if you can, can you see my mouse, you can't. Right at the top of the hill is the first, just over there is the first peak. You have to go up and then you have to keep walking. And we walked up a hill. It was like literally this steep, like at some points you almost wanted to be on all fours and we got to this style and I just stared at it and I was like I need a break because I cannot climb over that right now <laughs> so <laughs> that's why all our stuff's there because I had to have a break before I climbed over it was a really tough walk it was so fun though I'll come yay Artie will be there too hi Em's here hi Em finally catching one of these live yay um I'm just so you know, Emily, I'm making this. It's a concertina sketchbook. This lime green is not that lime, not that neon. And we're doing the background first and it's about to fall off the edge of the table. <laughs> and I'm going through my big long walk that I did last week. I was just telling people about it. And I'm basically stitching all of these photos together. It's like the walk from start to finish. So just in case you missed it and other people, if you've arrived, that's what we're doing. I, um, I watched all your vids, nice to see you here. Oh, you watched all of them? Yes, me too. I love art with them. Uh, what did you start with when you only had a few followers? YouTube, did you show your face straight away? It's a scary. I don't think you said it like with that accent, but that's how I read it. Um, yeah, I started with Instagram. Um, I'm trying to think, what is this line here that I did? You guys can't see that, thankfully. Uh, I have no idea what the line is, but we're just gonna paint it in with the sky. Um, so I started just putting stuff on Instagram. I didn't even know there was such a thing as an art Instagram. I was so late, like I'm, I was so late to using social media. I didn't get Facebook until it was a thing for like five years. And at that point, no one really cared about it anymore. Like even, you know, they, they care less about it now, I guess. But um, I started drawing and I didn't know anyone who drew. And I didn't even know that you could post stuff online. I think I just found out by accident maybe that people were posting online. So I started um, adding my, my drawings to it. And back then I was doing portraits because I thought that's what you had to do to be an artist. And 